Hi Gemini, welcome to your reading. This is a general love reading. Let's continue. First, let's shuffle the deck four times. Let's start with the current situation. Feeling a bit distanced feeling a bit angry, upset with them because they may have lied. There was some dishonesty that happened here. That is a big problem. You have been waiting, waiting to see progress. The progress has been very little. There may have been a third party situation. Somebody may have cheated here. I have the Three of Cups at the bottom of the deck, also the Seven of Swords. Now let's see what what is affecting you in your subconscious right now. Either it was a rejection in the past or you think that they are not interested anymore. That is what is affecting you in your subconscious. What happened in the past? What was the challenge? This caused much distress, anxiety, uncertainty, overthinking a lot about everything. So you didn't feel quite secure and certain in that connection and that love expression or vulnerability in being more expressive in the feelings may have not been that much. So they may have appeared cold or they were not expressing much feelings toward that connection towards you. And that made you confused. That made you stressed. I don't see much love and feelings from them in the past. It is a page of cups and it is in the position of the challenge or maybe they were not the time that uh, were very expressive with words on how they felt. Now how do you see the situation with them? You have feelings, stronger feelings than this past person. But you don't want to rush into something serious with them immediately. You want to take it one step at a time. And uh, yes, you'd like communication, but sometimes you think that by going back to that connection, maybe you are going to back to a situation that may have ended completely. Uh, a situation that cannot be relived or restored. Your focus is happiness, being content, peaceful, in having that inner peace. And as much as you'd like to hope that they will take some more initiative, that they will be more courageous or show some actions that they care about that past connection. Deep inside you don't trust this because you feel sad and disappointed about what happened by that behavior or event. A situation that may have closed you off totally from new experiences, new love potential, potentials as well. I think that you are getting, you have gotten and you will get new, better opportunities in love. But being so closed off may shut them down and give them the impression that you are not interested. So just be aware of that. Uh, now let's see about this past person. What are their energies towards you right now? Okay, they would like communication to happen. For some of you, this person lives in a distance away from you, or it may have been a long-distance relationship, so take what resonates in your case. But they want to see progress. They seem to have to be thinking more seriously now. They want more stability, commitment, they want progress. They don't like being stuck again. 
but their main problem is this, that they can't trust themselves opening up again to you. They feel a bit in shame or lack that confidence to approach you after all that happened. They feel like uh, there's lots of hurt and pain in, in this past situation. And that's why they lack that courage to take initiative. Now, I will continue this reading in the extended where I want to view more details about their feelings. What kind of feelings do they have towards you right now? How do they view you from the outside? What are their intentions at this moment? What are the energies? If you want to watch the extended of this video, you can find it now in the description box below this video. Or if you are watching this from your mobile phone, you can just click the title, the description box will expand, and at the top you can find the extended link. Thank you for watching, see you the next reading, and bye for now.